You gonna say whole thing? The garbage bag was too large and bulky to use as is. Oh, you scissors! Or the scalpel. Aha, uh -huh, a piece of plastic. Perfect. I tucked the bag into the vent. It held in place, but smoke still escaped. Tape! Tape, tape, tape. I carefully sealed the vent with the electrical tape, and the smoke quickly dissipated. Satisfied, I removed the gas mask. Ah, all right, good, uh, good night, Renata. I'll see you again. Do you ever jump when you see your own reflection out of the corner of your eye? Yeah, that just happened. The rusted sink was dry, as though it hadn't been turned on in years. The rusted sink was dry. The faucet knob turned, but no water emerged. So we try both? The faucet knob turned, but no water emerged. He's the same. The trash bin was empty inside, but the bag was full of holes. The seal held strong. Yeah, I think I did, did a pretty good job <laughs> covering that up. That is a good project. Luckily, I didn't have to go. Luckily, I didn't have to go. So what is the point of coming in here? <laughs> There's nothing! No useful items? Useless, guys. Can we break the mirror? <laughs> I don't want to see my own reflection. Break the mirror. Use the hammer. <laughs> What is the point of fixing this place up? There's a very tiny vent on this side here. Luckily, this vent was clear of smoke. Luckily. Okay, this is odd. Very odd. Okay, so now there's still a, a secret room <laughs> leading from the warden's office. Maybe it has something to do with the globe. We did put back that wooden top, the wooden stake, right at the top. But we, we can't even spin the globe. There is the star mark at the bottom. Expensive encyclopedias, dishware, and other related paraphernalia. Yeah. Not that nooked again. Drink table. Move the scones, maybe it's... Okay, maybe one of the scones to control the secret panel. Let's push this up back again. The scones. Far more decorative than the lights elsewhere in the prison. It seems Warden Duval spared no expense in building this office. Yeah, yeah, that's how people operate the secret passages, usually, in movies. <laughs> By turning the scones, turning them left or right. Far more decorative than the lights elsewhere in the prison. It seems Warden Duval spared no expense in building this. Okay, but not in this case. Okay, what about a secret button on the desk? Hold on. Secret button on the desk. Drawers. Pen. They say the pen is mightier than the sword, but in this case, I'd rather have the latter.
we have two unopened areas. The area beyond the, uh, the warden's office and also the morgue. Should we try another code? North gate, kitchen gate. I need to find a piece. Someone removed that piece on purpose. That section of the, pa uh, the paper with the mock code. The Warden's office has to be the key. Yeah. Okay, where else shall we go right now? Voices inside. Do you have a moment, Jesse? Is that a joke? Not a funny one. Why are you lying to us? What, what do you mean? You know precisely what I mean. You told the others that you hadn't left the reception restroom, but we both knew that you ventured to the visitors. I don't know what you're talking about. What are you hiding? You're making me uncomfortable, Grayson. Please, just, just leave me be. I didn't want to interrupt. Oh, uh, can I join the conversation? <laughs> I want to join them. Let's see if we can ch uh, trigger any more conversation <laughs> by uh, by going to specific places at specific times. <laughs> Looks like that's what we have to do right now to trigger these cutscenes. Maybe I need to search this place more carefully now. With so much junk littering the floor, you'd think there would be something that could help us. Sadly, there was not. Did she leave behind any body parts? <laughs> yeah, we know that she died here. She got fried on the chair, but uh... Anything else? Of interest? More books on justice. Someone was obsessed. I think it was some kind of generator. Then we check the bucket. Hair! Hair! Becca's hair cut off by some twisted fuck. Oh, that, that's why she was bald when we found her. And that's why there were scissors here on the chair earlier. Wow. Can we pick that up? No. Oh, I think that is all.
I didn't want to interrupt. I didn't see you inside. I can crawl through the vents. I think I can listen in from the vents. Hey, there's no one here now. <laughs> They're gone. Images of a human skull and chest cavity. There appeared to be a foreign object embedded in the chest. So this is probably the morgue door still locked. Though a light was on inside, there was no visible way to open the door from here. Yeah, I think this leads to the morgue. Anything new? There's absolutely nothing else. <laughs> So that means we have to go back to the director's office. How do we access the secret passage, guys? How do we access it? It's not one of the gate codes. Definitely not. Check the monitors. A live visual feed, courtesy of the security cameras that are scattered throughout this place. Creepy. And, and, and not a strange thing, it's a toilet! The restroom, the bathroom! <laughs> this is so strange, there's nothing new, no new items, no new clues. So what is the point of fixing the vents? There's nothing new here, guys. This is so weird. Maybe it's going to be a future crime scene? Luckily, I didn't have to go. Ever jump? Wait, patched floor? Patched floor? There's a diamond shape here at the bottom. Oh! The floor is definitely patched here. That's why. Not well. <coughs> it would be easy to break up. We have a scalpel and a hammer. I knew it. I knew there's a reason why we need to fix the vent. <laughs> there's got to be something new here. Oh, here we go. Perfect. That's a long way down. It leads to the mines. Might be, but it might be short enough to jump. We need to find a ball or something to drop down the hole. Listen to how long it takes to hit the ground. The basketball. I'll wait here. We'll see if we can find a ball or something. Basketball, basketball. All right, Simmy, I'll see you again. Thank you for dropping by. Basketball! Thank you. Uh, I haven't held a basketball since. Since high school? Will, hey! Up here! What are you doing? <laughs> uh. Sonny? How did you get up there? Be careful, There's Sonny. There's no time to explain. I need you to... Hello? Who's there? Oh no! Hey! Sunny? Sunny! Oh no! He's not moving! Attention everyone! We need to talk! Right now! Meet me in reception! Body number Have three. Heard, I met the others once again in reception.
Why do we have to keep meeting? It's not Gerald. Gerald is with me, guys. Well, what happened? You or you? <laughs> it's Sunny. He found a way onto the roof, but someone pushed him off. I, I saw him fall. Jesse or the FBI guy? He knocked his head on some pipes. He's, he's dead. I oh, actually, no, 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 no. His fate was to die in the same way as his friend did in the story Sonny told us. I forgot, guys. He is not with me. <laughs> I was alone in the yard. <laughs> he stayed in the bathroom, so he could also be the killer. <laughs> no. How should I respond? Lewis did too. Becca did too. Uh. Uh, what was the question again? <laughs> okay, let's just pick. I don't think this matters here. Louis? He's not the only one. Louis also died similarly to a death from his past. He was crushed by an elevator, just like a stuntman was crushed on set because of Louis. And Becca as well. I overheard her talking to Lewis earlier, and she confessed to electrocuting her husband in the bath. The curling iron. I heard that as well. You're saying this nut's trying to teach us a lesson? He called it justice. Well, justice or not, this is as far as it goes. I've seen all those B-rate slasher films. The second we separate, bam, another one of us dies. I say we stay together. <laughs> it's too late for that. Safety in numbers. Wow, it took you guys this long to figure it out. <laughs> Safety in numbers. That's the rule. <laughs> I agree, we need a plan. I plan. Doing that's pointless if we don't have a plan. We still need to find a way to escape. So what's our next move? How uh, the bat How did he get onto the roof? I don't see that on the map. Maybe through the director's office? The roof is not on the map. Or the pathway to the roof is not on the map. Bathroom hole, the roof. Uh, I think it's too late for the roof. I want to check out the bathroom hole, the hole. Maybe the mines. I think that leads to the mines. Gerard and I made a large hole in the bathroom floor. It looks like it goes down pretty far, but we may be able to jump it. It might be our ticket out of this place. Gentlemen, lead the way. Wow! <laughs> We're all together! We are all together. All four of us. How exciting is this? What the? The gates must be malfunctioning. Or someone is controlling the gates. It's the first time they've been used in years. I suppose it's possible. No, no, no. Go on ahead without us and release the gate. Don't forget to keep in touch via walkie-talkie. And we're separated again. <laughs> Alright, his picture crossed out. Someone has to control the gate. For it to close. In the control room. I don't think it can uh, close automatically or close by itself. That's not how it works. That's not how it works, guys. Shall we go take a look at the control room? no one here. I can open the gates for them now. 
that that's the uh, that's the north gate. I can open it for them. Five, seven, four, two. Five, seven, four, two. Okay, it's open. Uh oh, that's not not the right gate. That's not the right gate. Hold on. North gate. That's the visitors' gate. Oh, okay, okay, guys, okay. The visitors' gate. No, 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 no. That was the right one. That's the right one. We can only open one gate at a time. That's the problem. Okay, never mind. I tried. Let's open the visitor's gate first, so the others can come <laughs> with us. I just... Okay, I opened the north gate and didn't open the right one. <laughs> Alright, visitor's gate. Visitor's gate. Three nine seven five. Three nine seven five. Override. Override. What the hell does that mean? Well, they can use the vents. Jesse, Grayson, the gate control isn't responding. Something must be wrong with it. Use the vent. You guys can go through the van system, <laughs> like I did. Go through the vents. You can join us using the vents. Okay, so um, yeah, locker room. Try the basketball. Use the basketball. You think turning and tuning the globe in the direction so obviously like did this something? Uh, I put back that that wooden piece at the top. I didn't tilt it. I didn't rotate it. It just doesn't move. So I don't know what's going on there. We dropped the basketball into the hole. After two or three seconds, we heard a distant bounce. Wow, two seconds. A pretty long drop, but manageable. Two seconds. You call two seconds manageable? A two seconds drop? That is a very long job. Two seconds. <laughs> two seconds? Are you kidding me? Shall we go find ropes? Or tie the bedsheets together? That's what we usually do in casual adventures. <laughs> right, right? <laughs> tying, tying those bedsheets together, make a rope. <laughs> All right. Uh, I guess I will go first. No, you go first. <laughs> you can go first. I don't think I can survive with a two seconds drop. <laughs> Maybe you should go first. No, it gets pretty tight down there, and you're smaller than me. It's gotta be you. No way! No way! Are you forcing me down? I'll wait here and find something to pull you back up with in case it's a dead end. A two seconds drop? <laughs> I don't trust you. Uh, what, other, what choices do I have? He's forcing me down. <laughs> Shall we say this explicitly? I don't trust him. Okay, just okay. <sighs> All right. Good luck, man. It's With a trap. One deep breath. I jumped. Jump? That's even worse. 
just hang on the ledges and then fall. 